So sometimes even the best among us, the most compassionate and loving among us, feel like hurting people. You know, maybe not physically, but emotionally, maybe we just want to say something that's going to teach someone a lesson or put them in their place or whatever it might be. You know, we could say that it's human, but whatever it is, uh, we can also clear that urge. So, taking full responsibility for your own well-being. Just, you know, thinking about whoever you might want to be saying something to or doing something to that's not particularly loving. Even though I want to hurt this person, I choose to love and accept myself. Even though I want to hurt this person, I choose to love and honor myself anyway. Even though I want to hurt this person, and I know that's not the real me, that's not who I'm here to be, but I can't deny these feelings I have. of wanting to do harm. I could try to deny them, but that might make matters worse. So I'm acknowledging what I'm feeling and finding a better alternative. And even though I want to hurt this person, I choose to deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself. And maybe even this person, and maybe all the people who have hurt me, all the people that I've hurt, all the people I've wanted to hurt. And anyone else who might be involved in these feelings. I want to hurt this person. I want to do them harm. I want to stop them from doing stuff. I want to put them in their place. I want to teach them a lesson. I want revenge. All this need for payback. And I choose to clear these feelings. But first I have to acknowledge them. Maybe I felt this way for a long time, but I've suppressed these feelings. That's not me. I'm a good person. I don't want to hurt anybody. But if these feelings are in there, They're taking a toll on me. They're limiting my health and happiness. And they might even be growing. So I'm pulling them out, seeing them for what they are, and I'm releasing them. All through my life, I've seen people hurt other people. I've witnessed a lot of harm. I've experienced a lot of harm. And part of me has learned, well, that's just the way things are. 
So it's not surprising that part of me would resort to this. That part of me might think it would be a good idea to hurt someone. And I'm acknowledging that feeling. And giving myself permission to clear it. It doesn't mean that I'm a bad person for thinking this. I'm not, I'm not a bad person for having these feelings. I choose to clear this judgment. I choose to love myself. And at the same time, I choose to clear this need to do harm. It probably won't get me what I really want. And it might get me a lot of what I don't want. There are better ways to handle this. I might really want to do harm. But that's a scared part of me. That's a hurt part of me. And two wrongs don't make a right. Two hurts don't create healing. So I'm clearing this need to do harm. Clearing it at a cellular level. Clearing it all the way back through my past. I'd rather love people. I'd rather bless them. It's so hard sometimes. Sometimes I just need to teach him a lesson. And I'm moving through this feeling. If I'm going to teach them a lesson, I'd rather teach them a lesson of compassion. I'd rather teach them a lesson of love. Because that's what they really need. And I'm just the person to teach that. Clearing the stuff that gets in the way. Clearing this desire to hurt anyone. Setting myself free to share love. In body, mind, and spirit. Take a deep breath. And, as I like to say, lather, rinse, repeat as necessary. Thanks for doing so.